I don't really see how this thing is a Tyrannosaurus deer. I can see Tyrannosaurus kangaroo, maybe giant Tyrannosaurus kangaroo, maybe giant kangaroo, but not a Tyrannosaurus deer. Hey you guys, what's up? So I'm checking out this mod, and it is called the Tri Tyrannosaurus deer mod. But this thing is, by the way, I am sick again. Uh, yeah, I know, I, I got like super AIDS or something this time. This stuff's fucking nasty. Anyways, um... So, this thing is called the Tyrannosaurus Deer mod, and, uh, I don't see how this thing is a Tyrannosaurus Deer. It's basically just a big fucking kangaroo that jumps extremely fucking far. Now, don't get me wrong, I mean, I thought this was pretty cool to make something this big. Oh, and I can jump buildings in a single bound, except I'm not gonna make it to the island over there. Um, I think the mod's cool, yeah, but at the same time, I think, uh... I think they should have called it what it is, like the giant kangaroo or something like that, and not just Tyrannosaurus deer. Like, this in no way, shape, or form is terrifying like a Tyrannosaurus. And that's pretty fucking scary. If you have a Tyrannosaurus Rex coming at you, yeah, you're, you're gonna shit your pants, and your life will probably flash before your eyes ten times before you die. Either way, this is, uh, this is the mod here. I figured I showed it to you guys anyways. Because I have to speak to you guys about something. We just hit 4,000 subscribers and I'm going to make this on its own video too. But I wanted to get into it with this ARC mod. Because I don't know if my voice is going to last until tomorrow. I can feel it going already. And I can... I can almost guarantee there might not be an upload tomorrow because I was stupid. I didn't pre-plan. I didn't pre-record shit. Well, maybe I have some footage I can edit and, and throw up online, but I'm only going to do it if it's good and I like it. Um, yeah, we just hit 4,000 fucking subscribers, which is absolutely nuts to me because, like, it, it's like we're hitting these milestones. Like, boom, 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 boom. Like, 4,000 already. It's crazy. So we have an amazing community so far. We're building something that's going to be amazing in the future as well. Um, I wanted to thank you guys so much for that, because, like, I haven't really thanked you guys much lately. Thank you for driving by in that loud-ass car while I'm trying to thank these wonderful people, you asshole. Um, I haven't really thanked you guys much lately, and I'm not, I want you guys to know I'm not losing my roots. I'm not losing where I'm coming from with this whole YouTube thing. And that free games and stuff are still definitely a big, a big factor. Entertaining people, making sure people are are getting some kind of enjoyment from my video content. That's all a root feature, and it's all possible because of you guys that are watching this right now. I mean, right now you could be watching Markiplier, you could be watching Jacksepticeye, you could be watching anyone Slipgator, who is like the king of Ark. And I mean, you're here right now watching this video instead, which. I, I thank you so much for doing that because it gives the smaller content creators a fighting chance and I appreciate that so freaking much because I wanted YouTube to work so much. I wanted to be able to speak to people. I didn't want to just speak to myself and, and act like there was no audience there and I mean... For the longest while, it was like that. It was like that for sure. When you first start up YouTube, I mean, you you effectively fake it until you make it. I get, oh, whoa, whoa, hang on. What the fuck is this doing? Over oh, this is from my dung beetle video. This was like months ago. Dude, that is so cool. I didn't realize these guys were still over here. That's awesome. Um, but yeah, with YouTube, it's like you gotta fake it till you make it. Like, I started out, I had like two subscribers. Hello, Tyrannosaurus Rex. Oh, wow, you're high level. And uh, it was like... Um, I'd be talking, and it would be like, okay, you guys, so let's do this, and it'd be like, maybe me and a couple family members that would watch the video, and like, it was cringeworthy and shit, and like, now, I actually have this audience of amazing people who are supportive, who want to see me do good on this, it's, it's, it's something that I, I am very thankful for, and I am very thankful for each and every one of you that are here to help me out with this, and to support me, and... From the bottom of my heart, thank you guys so much for doing that because you're doing so much more than you could ever imagine for me because it's it's just it's just something that really matters to me. Really, really bad. 
but I will make it in my own video um, as well. And we'll probably talk about like the Bionic Giga or something because I have a couple ideas to pitch to you guys about what exactly that thing is. Next up on the agenda, um, Ark Survival Evolved. I want to get back into this game, but I unfortunately keep on hitting roadblocks with this game. And it's not that I hate the game. It's not that I'm bored of the game. It's not any of that. I've been looking around. Basically, I, um, I've faced two wipes so far from playing, uh, playing the game. I was playing on a, a server, obviously, and it's not—it's not the owner's fault. It's not—it's not anyone's fault at all. It's just I—I I associate with the wrong people. They do stupid shit, and then they get everything wiped. And then, what is that? What was—was was that a? Was that a supply beacon? I just noticed that. But no, I associate with the wrong people, and then those people turn into dicks, and then they do stupid shit, and. It's, it's, uh, I have such a bad freaking tendency to do that shit. But I need to know from you guys if you want to see the Let's Play on Ark Survival Evolved. I need to know if you guys want to see that series, if you want to see me doing that series, because I want to do that series, obviously, but I got to ask you guys if you want to see it too. Because if not, I can put my time into something you guys actually want to see, because there are many things that I would like to do that I'm sure you guys would like to see as well. And it's, I'm not, a lot of content creators. I'm going to go into a rant, uh, a little bit of a rant. A lot of content creators complain because they're like, oh, my audience doesn't want to see what I want to make. But at the same time, I mean, you are there to entertain them. And, like, I, I, that's the way I see it, at least. Like, I don't see it as, oh, it should be me playing whatever I want. It should be a mutual agreement between what your audience wants to see you play and what you want to play. There should be a common grounds there, and there should be something there that you guys both want to see. And that's what I do. That's what I like to do because while I might want to play Gary's mod and put that online on my channel I know one my channel is a survival based channel and two I would rather record Hurt World or, or, or Ark or something like that because I know you guys are going to enjoy it and I know right there that's that mutual agreement link that is that is that is the best way in my opinion to to uh to do this whole this whole thing with entertainment and uh as such I mean I'm not going to just get up one day and say, well, fuck it, I'm going to play only the games I want to play. Because at the end of the day, I mean, the channel is all about survival games, and I don't think I'm, I'm ever going to be in a position where I'm playing a game I don't want to play, because, I mean, Ark is cool, Hurt World is cool, Rust is cool, even though I don't upload much on Rust, because Rust is still a little bit of a weird game for me, but I'm working on some things. Um, but it is a cool game. Like, there's, there's so many different cool games that we have on this channel right now that we could play, and... I don't know. I'm going to end the rant there. I'm going to end the rant there before I dig a grave because it, it's, it just annoys me that content creators do that. And I don't see it that way. I, I think there should be, there's a common ground somewhere with everything between your audience and you. There is, it should never be, oh, well, you guys don't want to see uh, Gary's mod, but I want to play Gary's mod. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm not, I don't, I don't think that's right because then you're outing your audience and you are forcing them and you're forcing them basically to ha like deal with whatever you're playing and I don't know, it's just not the way I see it. Anyways, um, yeah, the ARC series because I keep on getting sidetracked and ranting and my throat's hurting and I'm in a bad mood because of this fucking flu, um... The uh, ARC series, I don't, there's not much to really watch on this video. I'm literally just running around talking to you guys on a giant kangaroo that was fake to be a Tyrannosaurus deer because the mod developed, whatever. Um, I want to do that ARC series. I want to know if you guys want to still see that ARC series because I know a lot of you guys want to see The Isle now because The Isle is a badass game. I actually like that game a lot. And I think they did a really good job and it has a lot of potential. Let me know anyways in the comments below if you want to see ARC. What else do you want to see? Let me know if there's any other survival games you actually want to see on my channel. Now, there was something else I was going to bring up. What was I going to bring up? Okay, so apparently I'm just... Oh, oh, yeah, okay. All right, all right. I remember now. Um, I have a tendency in my ARC videos, well, in, in any videos, I mean, to censor myself. And I censor myself in the way that I don't swear as much as I normally would. Um, and there are different word choices that I use that I would not normally use in my, like, in, in, in my video or in my real life, whatever, like... I, I am very unfiltered, and I am very crude as a person, and I can be very abrasive as a person as well, and I try to filter myself so I can appeal to anyone that watches my video content, because at the end of the day, I want people to be happy. Now, keep in mind, I keep as real as I can, 
with you guys. I'm not gonna full on fake and and just do this extraordinary bullshit of you know whatever. But I do keep it real with you guys. It's just I filter myself. I don't swear nearly as much as I would if I was not recording. I I use different word choices. Um, Ike the trike. Uh, that my that video that I did um, a little while ago actually was. Probably one of the most unfiltered videos I've ever done. It got amazing feedback, but I'm going to be experimenting with that stuff as well. And it's just because I want to see how you guys exactly handle me unfiltered. Me not choosing better word choices and me not being as spontaneous. Because it can kill creativity sometimes and I, I'd rather not do that, but at the same time... I mean, I'm not going to be a dick, like I said before, and make you guys conform to, you know, whatever it is I want to do. So, with that in mind, um, if the next couple of videos on the aisle or whatever are a little bit cruder than usual, well, that's probably why, because I've decided that I want to try this out, see how you guys like it, and if you guys don't like it, well, then obviously I'm not going to do it. I will I will reapply that filter and shit and not be a dick about it and just be like, oh, well, you guys got to listen to me because my channel is whatever. It's, it's our channel, first off, because we all watch the videos here. Even I do. I watch some of the videos. Um, but, yeah, where the fuck am I? Okay, alright, uh, I'm stuck. Okay, I'm not stuck. Anyways, you guys, I will stop taking your time here because I'm really not doing too much. This was the Tyrannosaurus Deer mod. Kind of cool. Wouldn't recommend it, but it was kind of cool to fuck around with. Thank you guys so much for watching. Look forward to the real 4,000 subscriber video very soon. Uh, leave your comments and suggestions below, and I will see you in the next video.